here with Catherine Pindell at the finish line, the uh, cross country women's pro today. Uh, 20 mile course, 30 kilometers. How did you feel out there? Um, I felt good, yeah. Like, I definitely felt uh, riding within myself, felt really comfortable in the climbs. I, I could hear the other girls breathing hard, so I know when I was leading, so I know that was good. Um, I just need to work a little bit more on my punch before the World Cups, and things will be good. You tend to, tend to pace yourself more anyway, don't you, at the beginning of seasons? You, uh, you know, you don't not typically. To... I'm like a pin it to win it kind of style. All the time? <laughs> yeah, yeah, usually. <laughs> um, yeah, no, like I definitely um, was trying to push the pace early on and create a separation because, I, I, like, you know, I didn't want it to come down to a sprint with Voss because I didn't like my chances, but uh, right. it, it happened that the sprints were midway up a really steep climb uh, about 20 minutes before the end of the race, and uh, they got me there anyhow. But, uh, no, it's good. Like, um, you know... Marianne is definitely on form. I think Annika's had some strong races already internationally this season. So they've been racing in my first race, and uh, I felt good. So uh, better things to come. Right. When those two are out of the picture, which is normally true, you, uh, you've you won this a few times. Um, you know, I don't think I've ever won this. I've lost it in a sprint before. You I've got won. lots of seconds here. Oh, you, sorry. Yes, you've done, you won the short. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, it's all a blur. The yeah. sea otter blur. <laughs> You're down there. Well, how did, what were these snafus here that you feel like strategically you could have technically gone better on? Um, you know, I felt like I rode a really clean race. I, I did a little positioning mistake early on, but I was able to make up for it. Um, really, the only thing is is uh, being able to attack really steep climbs, and uh, that's just something I'll have to work on. Were you all t uh, together but since we didn't actually get much? Uh, yeah, you can't see anything out there, can you? No. Um, yeah, uh, Marianne, Annika, and myself broke off about before the halfway point. We like it was the three of us with Georgia, Katarina, and. I'm not even sure who else, but uh, thank you. Um, but yeah, and then it just kind of like broke apart on the climbs, or people like slid out on a corner. Or it's super loose out there. Yeah. And then so it was three of us before the feed zone to the end for the last 20k, and uh, yeah. And the three of you, did you stay together? Three of you, more or less? Uh, until the three of us stayed together until about 15, 20 minutes of racing to go, and then Marianne and Annika got away from me, mm -hmm. and I just watched, chase them down. They were ahead of me in the distance the whole time. So. I mean, you've noticed from last year we had a really dry one for you as well. It was about 10, 15 degrees warmer. This is becoming a lot more sandy, almost like a desert classic out here. Okay. So. Um, yeah, it's definitely loose out there. And uh, I, me and my husband have been doing some cornering practice before this race, and it, it helped me for sure. <laughs> a few of the boys, Kabush and I, are going to play some uh, street hockey later on today. Are you joining any Awesome, of yeah. Sounds good. Get on it. Yeah, we got to go to the clip bar party first, though. But I think we Thanks also have so plenty of